Hey guys, and it's Silas here. Welcome back to Let's Play Oblivion. One of you pointed out that I missed some cool loot, which is actually on her table out here. She's left her base ring of restoration out in the middle of nowhere like an idiot. So what does this actually do? Does it heal me? Fortify restoration. Oh no, it just gives me a little bit more healing power. Now, can I fall down here without <coughs> taking any damage? No, I can't. Right. So, I can't remember what I said I was going to do in the previous video to do in this video, but I'm just going to go ahead and do whatever. Um, I'm not going to do this for a minute. Let's do... Um, hmm... Deep Scorn Hollow. Uh, I've never looked at this one, so let's have a look at Unearthing Mayrun's Razor. I've heard talk of a lost alien city called Varsa Balim, where Mayrun's Razor is hidden. If I search the ruins of Sundercliff Watch in the eastern Nibbon, I may be able to find the lost city and recover this powerful Daedric artifact. So in the eastern Nibbon, right across the other side of Tamriel. So it's all the way over here. So I'm going to head to this Nyon camp. Do a bit of uh, paddling through that little lake. Make myself... Make myself... Make my way to Sundercliff Watch. I don't know why, but I keep muddling up my words. Always muddling up my words. So we have got a bandit or something here. But we'll quickly dispatch them. And it looks like his mates up on the hill on guard duty. They're probably not going to spot us at all. You really thought mud crabs more fearsome than me? I doubt that very much, love. I bet you weren't defeated by this mud crab. If that mud crab was more fearsome than me, and I just killed you, then you must have been killed by the more fearsome mud crab also. So I'm heading over in this direction. I'm going to keep my detect life on just so I can see where the baddies are. Um, I'll meet you when I get a bit closer. So that... Oops. Don't want to equip my sword. Waste my enchant on this mud crab. Yeah, so I'll meet you over there. Um, or when the next quest what's it pops up. So I do believe this is Sundercliff Watch poking through the, the trees here. Um, looks like there's some baddies down there. So I'm going to sneak in if I can. Um... I find the entrance up on this rock here. Baddies all around, looks like I've dodged them all. So let's head inside here, see if we can find Mayrun's Razor, this long forgotten from the Riemann dynasty. So we now begin our search for Mayrun's um, Razor. Looks like some bad guys over there. I wonder if we should pick them off. I don't know if they're hostile. They are hostile. Dromir, Droth Mary Soldier. I'm going to have to be careful with my enchant in here because I'm going to run out of it fairly quickly. And I've never seen that before. I'll take all your Daedric arrows. Bow of Harm, damage 8, health on strike. That's cool. He's been absorbing my speed. Never seen a, an enemy die with a torch in their hand. So this is an interesting place here. It's like the fort was just inside a cave. Or primarily built inside a cave. What's in this chest? Gold and a silver nugget. I can sell that. What's on that table? Some armor and some things. A little ladder leading to nowhere. It's a cool statue holding on to some uh, candles. So it looks like this place is, is a bit wrecked. And it looks like we've definitely got more guys down here who uh, probably can't get through this door. There's an abandoned knapsack with a small diary in it. So it's a diary contains a password to explore further and seems to indicate that some kind of army is amassing here, led by somebody named Drothan. If I can find the journal in his cabin, maybe I can learn more. So someone's amassing an army. So let's say the password, Chimer, to open these doors and uh, release these guys. Are these more soldiers? Droth Mary soldiers, yeah. Oh, this is a steward. He might go down a bit faster. I think once my sword runs out of enchant, I'm not going to bother re-enchanting it. Oh my jeez. Or I might do actually. Have I got any healing potions? Um, yeah, so it's now I need to just decide whether I'm going to re enchant my sword or not. Let's see how easy these guys are going to go down. Although they are hitting quite hard, so it might be helpful if I did re enchant my sword. Re enchant it with a wolf soul I collected outside. Okay, I'm definitely going to die if I stay there. Um, this could be awkward. Yeah, I'm dead. Right, so I definitely re need to rethink this. Um, kind of need to take these guys out one at a time. Um, 
I don't think I'm going to be able to sneak into this place at all. Um, what can I do to take them out faster? I could paralyze them. That would certainly help me out a lot. Apart from keeping my sword enchanted. Take those Daedric arrows again, thank you. And uh, there's an abandoned knapsack. So let's get my paralyzed spell out. Because that certainly is going to be an advantage down here. Take my small diary again. I'll quick save here just before I open the door so that when they all come storming out hopefully looks like two of them are chasing me instead of the full three I had before they're not even following me up here so hopefully they're a bit dumb looks like they've closed the door again like spoons so let's open them open the door get them to at least follow me up here and I can start wreaking havoc on their poor souls there we go that is definitely a lot more effective with this paralyzed spell. So let's see if we can do the same thing. I need to re enchant it though, so I can take care of him. There we go. So these guys got anything on them? Steward's note. What's on this table? Oh my god, lots of loot on that table. So, what about this guy? He just had some junk on him. Right, so let me sneak down into here without alerting that person across the other side of the bridge. See what we've got here. Steward's registry, forward detachment registry. So he's got a list of all flipping heck a lot of people that have been assigned to this whatever this place is, this underground fort recently. A couple of sacks, some money bags, no doubt. Um, what did that steward's note say? Steward's note. Your job is to see that our arrivals and departures are well documented. So basically, this guy... Who's that signed by? Durfan. Drofan. Drofan. Um, so that guy was in charge of keeping track of who's entering and leaving. Nothing to worry about, I guess. Obviously he didn't uh, register the fact that I'd just entered. Because I killed him before he had a chance to. So I'd really like one of these guys to chase me up here so I could actually... If I can take care of all the uh, the melee guys first, I suppose that would be a good idea. Let me just use my grand. I've got ten grand soul gems. I suppose I'd be a fool not to use them. Just so I can take these guys out in the blink of an eye. Um, what's he got? Just junk on him. Um, these archers are no doubt going to be difficult to take care of. There's another guy down there. Hopefully that guy doesn't attack me whilst let's just charge at them. Paralyze him, take him down as quick as I can. Okay, that guy's got his sword out now. So these are the new recruits. Got some nice equipment on them. I'll have your Daedric arrows again. You got any money on you? No? So what's around here? So one of them was hanging around down here, so this is where they were sleeping. What's around at the corner? A um, couple of arrows, Daedric arrows just lying on the floor. I'll have those for no particular reason. Um, the other one was hanging around here. There's another recruit come up to cause me some trouble. Let's run out of enchant again. Okay, I'm going through this enchant like, like nothing. You've got just junk on you. Um, oh, there's one more guy down there. Didn't see him. Whoops, wrong spell. I want to paralyze you. Sorry about this, won't take a minute. I'll have that. Nasty evil extracted from you in a moment. So more Daedric arrows. I'm gonna be weighted down with Daedric arrows pretty soon. It's this tiny little barrel. Um, and some money? No, weak potion of he healing. Actually, I'll take that. Won't heal me for much, but it's handy to have any potions of healing, really. So, looks like we're getting deeper into this place. Whatever it is, it's in this sack. Just some junk. Um. So it's now turned back into a cave, so it's like a cave into a fort, back into a cave, back into a fort. Look at this place, this is like one of those huge outside forts, but massively underground. Let's see if we can sneak around here, see what's going on with these things. I suppose we should, whoops, sneak down the stairs. Let's take a pot shot at this guy. Let's get some flame damage on him before I start attacking him with my sword. Do the same old thing. It looks like they were camped out under the stairs here. So you're a veteran, you're tougher than everyone else I've caught so far. You were casting spells on yourself. 
Um, so yeah, you're definitely camped out down here. Foodstuffs. Surely Brothers Wine will take that thing that sells quite 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 a portion of, of gold. So we're heading deeper now. This is Sundercliffe Village, so there's actually a village under all of this gump. So those were obviously the guards. Just um, hanging back, protecting the place. There's probably gonna be more guards. Don't know if the villagers are going to like try and attack me. Should be interesting. What's this? Iron ore on the floor there. Looks like they've been mining, trying to get some more goods out of this place. Holy cow, this really is an underground village. So the villagers are going to attack me? Yes, they are. Oh no, this is a recruit, not a villager. Um, items run out of enchant. So I can kill this guy before he gets up. There we go. That was stealthy. I don't know how no one heard all this screaming that guy was doing. So it looks like we want to head down there where those guys are going. Um, I don't know how much of this village I really want to explore. I don't know if everyone's going to be aggressive. Um, I can always explore the village on the way out, I guess. Oh god. No, nope. I've been spotted by some people. I don't think they can actually get up, get at me right now. Or they've got a long way to go to be able to get at me. Um, let's just see who this is. Is this a recruit sleeping here? Nope, it's a soldier. So, this place is full of soldiers. And um, they are going to attack me on sight. So, with the amount of people here, I think stealth would be the, the best approach, if I can. And apparently I haven't been spotted at the moment. Maybe those guys saw me and then they lost me. So maybe it's a good idea not to go exploring this village whilst I'm invisible to everyone. But it looks like I'm heading through here. The Sundercliffe Commune. Looks like they gave up searching for me because the music changed right there. It looks like this is a secret passage that's just recently been opened or something. Or it's just more village down here. Um, there's guards wandering about. Your presence here will not be tolerated. Neither will yours. <laughs> Silent takedown. This sword is amazing, whilst it's enchanted. Um, that guy's wandering off into the distance. I need to get over here, so let's see if I can sneak around the edge of here. Although I do believe I need to get over there somewhere. So I need to cross that bridge at some point. Hello? So I might have to take this guard out. Although if I can take him down quietly. I can sneak a shot into his back. Just to attract his attention. I went straight past him. Maybe I can run behind him whilst he's not looking. So it looks like I need to head into... Frathis... Frath... Frath... Was it Frathis? Dothran's quarters. Anyway, the guy who's leading this... Dorthan. Is it Dorthan or Drothan? Drothan. Drothan. Something like that. This is Quarters. So this is the guy who's running the whole thing. So he's got some nice loot that they've been collecting. What's in these sacks? More gold. And more gold. So he's got some scroll of transmutation. What do they do? What's transmutation do? Um, where's my scrolls? I forget where my scrolls are kept. Then here, uh, transmute mineral on self. Whatever the heck that does. So there's a vala stone. Varieties of data, a couple of soul gems. I'll loot all of this because it's, it's trichobazor extract or trichobazor. What does this do? Cure poison, resist poison. That's cool. So here's his diary or his journal that we were looking for. So he's gone to Versa Balim in search of something called the Nefar. Nefari, <laughs> Nefari Vidium, which he believes protects Mayrun's razor. He has left enchanted bezoars in the care of his commander and forward master. With those bezoars, I'll be able to dispel his enchantment and follow him into Versa Balim. So does that mean I have to take out his guardians? Are there any rare books in here? The Eastern provinces impartially considered. I don't think I've got that. Don't ask me why, I'm just like obsessed with um, collecting rare books. That's what I like to do. Is there a seat for something there? What's he been buying? Oh, the books. The book was damaged. Good grief. The treatise on uh, Aleodic Cities. That was a rare book from the looks of it. The Lusty Arcadian Maid. Everyone has got a copy of that book from the seams of it. Um, so what's downstairs in his 
this little place. Um, let's head out the back door. Is there a back door? No, I'm imagining things. There's only a front door. Um, so his guardsmen have the the potions I need or something like that. So there's one of them. Okay, that's not one of them. Oh dear. Just attracted the attention of this guy for no reason whatsoever. My what's just ran out of enchant. Okay. Um, let's enchant it with one of these other soul gems I picked up just so I can save the other stuff for later. More Daedric arrows, just a couple there. Um, so that must be one of his guards just there. And the other one must be around there. Oh, oh no, maybe his guards are asleep. Oh, this is the commander's quarters, right? So I need to kill the commanders to get those bezoars. No idea how to pronounce those words. So is this guy going to attack me once he sees I'm here? Yes, yes he is. Well, let's take him down swiftly, like I've taken everyone else down so far. Reenchant my sword with these rubbishy soul, soul gems, and hopefully he should have something on him I need. Oh, grand rock grand ring of freedom! Wow. So, um, he was supposed to have something on him that I need. Maybe he's got it stored around here somewhere, or did I already pick it up? Let's have a look around. Um, can't remember what I'm supposed to be looking for. It's apparently um, around here somewhere. Anyway, let me just have a quick look what I'm looking for. Um, he left his Bezoars in the care of his commander and forge master. So I'm looking for Bezoars, whatever the heck Bezoars are. Um, oh, more surely Brothers Wine. It's a nice thing to collect if you're looking for money. I uh, wonder where he'd keep it. That probably keeps it in that chest with any luck. Hmm. Ah! It's these orbs is the thing I'm looking for. So I need another one to... I need a pair of them so I can get past his enchantment. I don't think I've got this. I'll take that anyway. Steal his books. Oh, and some really cool Guide to the Imperial City things. In paper... F oh, no. Oh, I thought I was looking at these little map things. I thought that was really cool. Oh! Psychic Motion. That'll be a... A what's it spell? I've forgotten what they're called. A psychokinetic, whatever it is. So his forge master is over this way somewhere. Possibly down, down this this ramp. There's a guard over there. Hopefully he won't spot me. Some strange lights over there. I bet that's where the thing um, is, where the enchantments are that I've got to get past. So his forge master, is this the forge master's place? Oh right, the forge master must live in Sundercliff village. Uh, I don't know if I want to go through this door because there might be guys right on the other side of the wall. Oh crap. Um, well, I'm going to quick save right here and then proper save. Um, and I'll see you in the next video. So until then, take care. We'll do more exploring of Sundercliff looking at this forge master in the next video. See you then. Take care guys.